Hey everyone, Dante here with The Raging Geek, and today I have the Harry Potter's wand with illuminating tip. This is from the Noble Collection. I got this particular wand at Walgreens. This was $29.99. As far as I can tell, the only place I can find this is at Walgreens. They're currently sold out on Walgreens.com. I got this particular one at my local Walgreens. Um, I don't believe they have any left at the Walgreens that I picked it up at, so they're going fast. If you look at my previous video, I did a wand from Target. It was a $14.99 wand from Spin Master. The wand from Target is just under a foot long, so just under 12 inches. This particular one is a 14 inch wand. I also noticed they have a similar wand on Amazon.com that they're selling for $35. It's also from the Noble Collection. The only difference that I can tell between this wand and the wand on Amazon is that the one on Amazon comes in a fancier display case. Originally that wand was $49.99. It's going currently on Amazon 30% off for $35. We're going to open this up, take a closer look. This is the Harry Potter wand with illuminating tip. This is from the Noble Collection and it's at Walgreens. Let's open it up and take a look. Out of the box, you get a Noble Collection product guide here. It comes with a, lots of great stuff um, from the Harry Potter series to Lord of the Rings to The Hobbit, uh, Fantastic Beasts, things like that. Um, really cool stuff in here. You know, you get a lot of the uh, a lot of the beasts from the Fantastic Beasts. Something to take a look at if you pick this up. Great product guide. So out of the box, this wand, it requires two AAA batteries. It does not come with the two AAA batteries. You have to install them. So the battery compartment in the bottom of the wand, um, there's basically a slot here where you put this notched key in and you put it in to open. You go counterclockwise. Once you put the batteries in, you reclose it going clockwise. So once the batteries are in, you're going to to activate the wand, you're just going to flick your wrist, and that's it. And you have your illuminating tip. There's a button on the wand handle here. Basically, the button, it just controls the light intensity. So you hold the button down, it'll go from dim to bright, and vice versa. So I'm just holding the button down. As you can see, it's getting dimmer and brighter. Dimmer and brighter. And that's it. So comparison with the Target one I had previously picked up, you can see the difference here. A couple of inches bigger with the Walgreens wand. You're looking at 15 more dollars uh, for the Walgreens wand. The Walgreens wand looking more true to scale as far as a wand goes. It's got a good heft to it. You know, the plastic doesn't feel too, too cheap. Um, you know, I wouldn't go banging it or anything like that. I mean, you wouldn't do that anyway with the magic wand, but as far as detail, uh, take a look. I mean, it's your basic plastic replica. Here's the button. I mean, I'm sure you could do some customization uh, to this. You could probably tape the tip and then the handle and then spray the wood wand like a nice spray coat to give it an added realism. And then after that dries, you could probably do the same with the handle. Um, you know, not that it's not fine out of the box, but I mean, for perfectionists out there, cosplayers, things like that who like to customize their replicas or accessories. I think there's definitely options with this wand that you could uh, you could probably experiment with. At least for the shaft of the wand, I think uh, you know, I might be somewhat, sometime down the road I, I might be inclined to spray it because um, it definitely would look a lot better if you sprayed it. So, uh, $29.99, would I buy this again? Uh, yeah, you know, it's pretty cool. Uh, you know, for a toy, I think kids will get a kick out of it. The manufacturer says age is 10 plus. Um, you know, it's they say it's a choking hazard, small parts, not for children under three. Um, I'm assuming they mean possibly the key, you know, or the maybe the battery compartment or the, you know the batteries themselves. For adults, definitely a great cosplay accessory for 29.99. Uh, you know, just for Harry Potter fans in general, great replica, something to display. 
definitely some customization potential if you do that sort of thing. Wand on, wand off, wand on, wand off. Great toy. Run down to your local Walgreens, check it out. It's the Harry Potter wand with illuminating tip. I would definitely pick it up again. This was the Raging Geek. Hope you enjoyed this video. Come again soon. Take care. Raging Geek Retro All Things Geek We're Geeks and Be Geeks Raging Geek Retro All Things Geek We're Geeks and Be Geeks